you today, and it's a very specific kind of haul, and I'll get into it in just a moment. Uh, if we look familiar, if this getup looks familiar, that's right, because I'm filming two videos in a row. So you're not confused, you're not senile, I am indeed uh, wearing the same outfit and have the same makeup look. So, today I'm going to be doing the first of at least several videos like this in a row, which I'm calling, What Did He Really Bring Me Today? And in these videos I'm going to show you the random kind of stuff that I get through eBay. And uh, if you like these kind of videos, please give them a some. If you like these kind of videos, hit the thumbs up button. And uh, that's it. So without further ado, let's jump so right into it. So the first very random <laughs> items that I got, there are two items, are these uh, Kitty It <laughs> kind of post-its. Basically, instead of saying post-it, it's a Kitty It. And they're little, you know, tabs and with little kitties on them. And since I need tab post-its, this was really cute and I like this. So I'm thinking that will, you know, spruce up the... Uh, I have a, I have these books that I'm not allowed to write in any, and I don't, I'm not allowed to write in them and they're meant for uh, testing and I can only mark like tabs like this and sh to show different references to different laws so that's what I'm going to do and I think I'm going to have the most original kind of uh, tabbing <laughs> going on in my entire uh, grading test and the other thing that I got is this little booklet it's this Parisian cat on it. They had like different designs. And inside it has three different kinds, three different sizes of, again, post-its. So you have this size with the little kitty on the corner. And you have this half size. And you have these little, t again, tabs. So I really like that. I really like this kind of stuff. I really like notebooks and pens. I'm addicted to pens. I love pens. And um, I really like kind of making little notes and jot things down. And I can always use this in my scrapbooking, so why not? So I really like this. This was the first two items that I got. The other thing that I got really, really kind of obsessed with was getting eyelashes. And I decided to pick up a few eyelashes. So, you know, I get stuff on eBay like for a dollar, two dollars, three dollars, like jewelry and stuff like this. And when they come in, they come in. So it's not like a one big giant haul. It's like a bunch of little things. So I got these eyelashes. There's ten in each. And one of them is number five and one of them is uh, number eight. One of them is simply a fuller kind of lash. Very, very... Um, tight as you can see and this one I think it doesn't look I'm not going to say the word natural because it definitely does not look natural uh, but these look very 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 strong and bold <laughs> the other item that I got is another kind of mm, I'm not sure what to call it but it's these uh, fake eyeliners open your eyes to resist to the easiest application and they're basically like these sticker tattoos and I got three of these were like a dollar a piece just just for fun sometimes you get stuff like this just for fun and I got this pattern and this pattern that I really like and I got this really interesting kind of pattern so all in all I have 12 I'll probably mess it up at least a few times Maybe I should do, like, uh, when I put these on, maybe I should, like, film a video of me putting these on. Tell me if you want that down below in the down bar. Um, again, back to eyelashes. I got more eyelashes. I got these, uh, which are really interesting. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them. I can tell you this much, that with all the, eyelash with all the eyelashes that I ordered by now, Really, I don't need any eyelashes anymore because I barely use them as, there, as it is. But the, the basic recommendation that I got, and I also like getting these, at least for when I'm starting to f f uh, fool around with uh, eye with eyelashes, because then if they like, if I screwed up, I can like throw these away and I don't feel bad about it. And like those Mac uh, eyelashes, I keep saying eyeshadows for some reason, are really expensive, and also other companies, and I never quite understand why. So. Yeah. Okay, so the next thing I did was, I don't know why, but there was like this huge crave on the Facebook pages that, uh, Facebook groups that I surf in. And everybody got like a bunch of um, $1 earrings, so I also went. And sometimes things look very different in reality. Like, I got this pair, which is actually a pretty cool pair. And then, for some reason, I also got the pink one. I'm not such a big fan of the pink one. It makes me feel a little bit too... What's the word? It's too much. It's too pink. It's too glittery. So I'm not sure about that one. So, And I have a friend who actually liked them, so I'm probably just going to give them to her. And there was another really cute pair, and I really like this. And it's just like going to be an old 
an everyday kind of earring and that's really cool and these were like a dollar a piece I love stuff like this because I just I just like little accessories to pump it up so I really like these and I know that I'm going to be wearing these a ton the last two items that I'm going to show you are these uh, cuff bracelets uh, these are now Here's the thing, Tibetan stands for a lot of really cool kind of finishes like this. I'm actually going to take them out of the bags. Why am I keeping them in the bags? So anyways, uh, I got these two uh, cuff bracelets and they have different finishes. Now when you look on these online at the seller, he has a bunch of different ones, uh, a bunch of different thicknesses. There's several sellers that are looking. Just look for um, bracelet, Tibetan bracelet. Tibetan stands for basically this kind of a look and I really like these. I can definitely see working them in. They're not that big so they're just probably gonna be like sit right there so I, I'm not gonna put them up here or anything like that but you know sometimes you just need like something to pump up your uh, appearance and this is a really cool finish because it's not a very strong kind of shiny silver it's like a mattified silver if that makes sense and for that reason I really really like it so um, definitely I'll try to find the link and post it down below so you can go check out at least some of these links and that's it for today so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you want to see more of my videos and want to follow me please subscribe down below show your appreciation and and all my social media links will be down below in the down bar. Uh, my Twitter, my Facebook, my Pinterest, my Instagram, my Facebook page, and my blog page. So that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them down below in the responses. And have a lovely day, fashionistas. Bye.